33. Best Bedroom Plants What plants are best for bedrooms? Houseplants can help you sleep better by helping to create peaceful, quiet, and relaxing spaces. They provide a humidity boost to the surrounding air, and although they don't do a massive amount of it, they can clean the air and reduce dust. There is a common myth that plants in the bedroom are bad news. We thoroughly debunk this with some scientific experiments and evidence in this article. You can use essential oil to help you sleep better, but have you thought about adding some popular houseplants into your sleep spaces instead? This is our guide for the 33 best indoor plants for bedrooms. We're often asked what are the best plants for bedroom air quality or which are good plants for bedroom oxygen at night. Others have to deal with low light or only want low maintenance houseplants in their sleeping spaces. That's a lot to take into account. With this in mind, we've created a list of 33 best plants for your bedroom to help you out and give you some inspiration, as picked by the Our Houseplants team. How we ranked the plants Multiple factors were looked at when compiling our list, but here are the main things we were thinking of as it was all put together. Do they release oxygen at night? Some houseplants will release oxygen at night through a special type of photosynthesis called crassulation acid metabolism CAM. Many people like the idea that plants are oxygenating the air while sleeping, so this factor was heavily weighted. How easy are they to grow in typical bedrooms? There is no point trying to grow indoor plants that won't like the typical environmental conditions of a bedroom, generally cooler and sometimes receive less light than other rooms. Low maintenance plants for bedrooms are also a big plus as many people don't want too much fuss or clutter. Are they good looking bedroom plants? Most house plants can fit into many bedroom decors and designs, but some fit in better than others. No plants on our list will look out of place in bedrooms. General price and availability all plants on our list are common and usually priced fairly. No rare house plants here. Now we've explained this, let's look at the best ones to add some greeny and hopefully help improve your sleep spaces. Hi, I'm Tom. If, like me, you enjoy the challenge of getting your houseplants to thrive and watching them grow, then our houseplants can help. This website shares my knowledge and years of growing plants and provides, hopefully, helpful advice on properly caring for your indoor plant friends. 33. Cacti. Almost all cacti release oxygen at night using the crassulation acid metabolism CAM, which means they can make excellent plants for a sunny bedroom. However, you need to keep them away from any areas you might walk past in the dead of night. Stumbling along while you go to the toilet could be very unpleasant. They're a little fussy because they're going to need some direct sunlight and their spines can be a problem. This is the reason they're not featured higher up our list. As long as you can provide a south-facing window, various cacti can be grown in these spaces. 32. English Ivy There aren't many climbers and trailing plants on this list, but English Ivy is one to consider in place of the more popular Devil's Ivy, Epipremimorium. Ivy is incredibly versatile and you can have it in a compact pot on a bedside table or leave it to hang down from a bookshelf or stand. This one is also ranked number 6 in NASA's and Dr. Wolverton's study into air purifying plants. In return, all it needs from you is a medium temperature in a position away from direct sunlight. Heterohelix, common ivy, will easily fit into most bedrooms. 31. String of Hearts. Another CAM plant that releases oxygen while you sleep. With multiple stems holding small heart-shaped leaves, it's beautiful and practical. This is another trailing plant that looks best when hanging from a vertical edge. It's also very easy and low maintenance, providing you can give it some water every week or so, you can mostly leave it alone to do its thing. Serapija woodii string of hearts with their small dainty heart-shaped leaves. 30. Living Stones Living Stones
Living stones. A very unusual houseplant and potentially the smallest houseplant we've ever written about. It's tiny and perfect when space is a premium but you want some life in your room. However, it does need some sunlight, so low-light bedrooms aren't suitable. But if you have a small space to fill on a table or windowsill that's bathed in the sun for at least a few hours a day, this could be a contender. Lithop's living stones are very simple to keep. Provide some water every now and again along with lots of bright light. 29.